The first day on the job as Italy's Prime Minister-designate, and Giuseppe Conte is already battling fierce opposition to his proposals. On Thursday, he was locked in the Parliament building for a day of consultations with political parties. A former lawyer and university professor with no political experience, his appointment came as a shock to many. Political analysts are left questioning how qualified he is to run the country. I see him as a, a weak premier, but we'll see. I say weak because this government wants to uh, change Europe, wants to change Italy. They call it government of the change, exactly, change government. And I think that uh, a government that wants to do these, these things, these, which are very, very complex and difficult, has to have a stronger uh, head of the government, a stronger uh, prime minister, but we'll see. Conte is set to form a new cabinet, handpicked by new coalition partners, the Five Star Movement and the Far Right League. While both parties work to settle their differences, the Five Stars leader Luigi Di Maio said their main focus was addressing the needs of the people. We're a governmental political force. Let's start with the weakest citizens, those who have been cut off from all the public politics of this country. Those who don't have jobs, who do business and can't make it through the month because they pay more taxes than profits they make. Let's talk about everything relating to social rights. Social rights that have been destroyed by the left. We can now put them back in place. Tax amnesty is one thing and the settling of tax disputes is another. Giuseppe Conte will present his cabinet to President Sergio Mattarella for endorsement before seeking parliamentary approval. A vote of confidence is set to be taken by the middle of next week.